Yo, what's cracking, everybody? Oh, it's Friday. Friday, 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 Friday. What more can you say? But it's the weekend. Um, this is actually was supposed to have been video number three of this week, but unfortunately, uh, something went wrong with my computer earlier. It erased the first one I did so this is gonna be video number two um, thankfully the one I did yesterday I didn't I didn't upload to my computer yet so I still have it and then I got this one so but I'll try to go into detail you know talk about what all went on but um Tuesday was actually the day everybody left, and that was when I did a video, but, or a video, sorry, I know I keep messing that up, but, um, I did a video, um, and I was just talking about the day, you know, I'd gotten up and everybody was gone, I talked to them throughout the day a couple times, and it was a really good day. Yeah. So I've been around the house. It's been sunny every day. There's been a breeze blowing, so it's been really pretty weather. Um, I was able to get out uh, earlier today and around lunchtime. Or no, it was before lunch. Yeah, it was before lunch. And I went ahead and I burned all the household garbage. So I got that out of the way. And cleaned up all the dishes, washed my dishes. So I got all that stuff put away, got everything cleaned up, so the house is neat and nice for whenever they come home. Um, but yeah, so it's, uh, like I said, it's Friday. It's the end of the week. They're on their way back. Um, it's 4 o'clock. They should be, let's see, they were in Canton at 3, or maybe after. Depend on how long it took them to load the box to load that box plate up for the tractor. Um, so they should be on their way home because uh, it's like seventy something miles from Canton to here, but that's that's just driving. That's not with traffic and everything. So, um, so I'm just kind of hanging out here. I'm gonna go grab a shower in a little bit. But, uh, but, yeah, they're on their way back. It's kind of a uh, happy and sad thing right now. I'm happy that they're coming back, but I'm sad because you now it's not going to be peaceful and quiet around here anymore. Um, but, I mean, that, that's fine. It's, you gotta, it's just something you got to live with. So, but, um, Well, like I said, you know, we're going to be doing a, my next video here recently is going to be, um, uh, when was it? Oh, yeah, it's going to be when we take, uh, my cousin's four-wheeler to be worked on. So, unless I make one ahead of time, that should be the next one, though I may go to Helen Sunday, since I skipped last Sunday. So, I may do that, make a video ahead of time. That's about it that's going on around here. Um, sorry, I know I keep pausing. I, every time I hear a vehicle go by, I keep listening to, you know, see if that may be my folks coming back. Because um, where our house is at, like, maybe... A football field away we have a gate put up uh, it's a uh, an electronic gate you have to punch in a passcode and then it'll beep real loud so every time I hear a loud vehicle go by I keep listening to see if I can hear you know maybe hear the beeps coming from that gate but still haven't heard anything yet so uh, they may make it home in time or if they don't, 
we're actually going to be going to Helen tonight to eat. So if they don't make it home before it's time to go, I may just meet them in town. Um, I had actually thought about going ahead and, and, you know, trying to drive over there tonight and just hang out tonight and skip Sunday, but... I mean, it seems like a good idea. I just don't feel like doing it, you know? You ever had those days where you think up something that sounds like a good idea, but you just don't want to put in the energy and the time and effort to do it? So. I think I'll just hang around here. Go eat with them and have a good time and then come back here. To me, that sounds a lot better. But, um, but yeah. And like I said, I know in some of my videos, you know, my videos here of late may not seem all that interesting. But, trust me, you know, the viewers that I have, if, got, if you guys will just hang in there with me, you know, as time goes on, as the, you know, as the year, as this year gets on into it, Trust me, these videos are going to get a lot more exciting. Um, but you guys know how it is. I mean, usually always around the first of the year, it's first couple months in the year, you know, there's nothing really all that exciting. That's kind of the way it is with the videos, you know, when you start making them, you know, to start off with, they're not going to be all that exciting to watch. But the more videos you make, you know, as the year goes on, the more exciting stuff you do. Um, I had spoke yesterday in my video that I did about the car show they're having up in Pigeon Forge. Um, like I said, I'm definitely going to be doing some vlogging on that and going up there. I'm going to try to see if the whole bunch wants to go or because it's only like from here where I live, it's only like a three hour drive, which is not bad. I mean, you could you could make the trip there and back in a day get up early that morning go and then later on that evening you know you could drive home so I mean you still you still get to use up the whole day but uh, I'm gonna try to see if you know if the whole bunch wants to go or if I can just go up there myself because really all I want to do I just want to go up there and look at the old cars and trucks you know vlog some of them, do videos, and then come back. I mean, I'm not going up there to stay, to try to stay. Um, and they have it usually for about three or four days. I'm not looking to do all of that. I'm looking to, you know, um, they do it down Main Street, but you can walk Main Street in a day. Both sides. But I think what they're wanting to do, because I've, I've talked to them about it before, I think what they're wanting to do is go up there and get a hotel and then stay overnight, maybe like one or two nights, and then come back because, like I said, you can go up there. You can only walk one side of Main Street in a day. You get up early that morning and get on Main Street from one end of it to the other, and you can walk it in a day, but it will take another day to walk down the other side, so that's probably what we might end up doing is... uh I'll probably drive up there, take my grandparents with me, and uh, we'll probably get us a hotel or something and get us a room for the night. And, uh, and then do it that way, because that's what I want to do. I want to be able to get up there, spend the rest of that day when I get there looking around, and then stay the night, get up the next day, use that whole day. To go looking around, look at all the cars and the trucks, and then stay that night, and then get up the next day, you know, spend a few hours looking around, and then come home. But, we'll, uh, we'll just kind of play it by an ear and see what happens. So, um, I'll definitely be doing some lake some vlogs at the lake um, I've got 
from just getting started. I've got all kind of vlogs coming out that I'm just sitting here just starting to think of. So, like I said, as the year goes on, these videos are going to get more entertaining to watch. I promise you that. It's just hard to really do anything entertaining, you know, when you are at home all the time. You know, you, you feel like you're vlogging the same old thing every now and then. And I don't want to do vidges, vidges of the same old thing, you know, every day or every week. You know. I mean, I've gotten, I look, went back and did an update on my channel. And I've gotten a, quite a bit of views. I think, like, close to 100 views already, which is pretty good. I mean, that's, that's pretty good. It might be the same people, but, I mean, hey, at least I am getting views on my videos, so. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Just, you know, updating that folks are coming home today, so. Um, I haven't been able to do, really do any video on, uh, on my deer stand so what I'll try to do is go out tomorrow and take my camera with me and I'll go out there and just kinda do a video of everything that's been done so far you know let you guys see it you know show you what we've got what I've gotten done so far and what's left to do and then show you what you know where I'll be hunting what the view is like but for now, I've got my uh, my trail cam set up right now, trying to see you know what kind of movements coming through. And I've been doing that since Christmas, and I haven't had much luck. I've captured one deer on there; it was a big doe, and uh, but she was kind of skittish. She never would come. I had a salt block uh, set up for her, but she never would come near it. She kind of stayed off off in the trees a little bit, but you could see, you know, there's enough light that when the camera took the picture of her, you know, you could see her face. You could kind of get a silhouette of her body, and uh, she looked like a pretty good sized doe. You know, she that was she was a good take in size. So, but season was already over when I saw her. Um, and that's another video I'm gonna do. I'm gonna be doing hunting vlogs this season when hunting season comes in for me I'm definitely gonna be doing that don't know if I'll get anything in every single video but I'm gonna be doing all that I can um, I'll have it set up you know the whole time we're there from when I get started to as soon as I get in the stand I'll set the camera up and I'll vlog from then until I get out of the stand hopefully we'll all get something on camera So. I've definitely got to step up my game on that this season. I managed to get three in all this past season, which wasn't a lot. Um, so this coming season, I'm hoping to get a lot more. Um, I wasn't really, I really wasn't as faithful to it, to hunting as I thought I was going to be. Like I intended to get up every single morning, every evening and go out. I went in the evenings, but in the mornings it was, I mean, I was really putting no effort into it, but, um, yeah, so that'll be another video to come, so. but I'm gonna go ahead and close this one out, um, I got some other stuff I gotta do, uh, while I'm waiting on my folks to get here, so we can go eat dinner, I'm looking forward to that, I love me some Mexican food, um, and what we got for that is we got a La Cabana in uh, Helen. Now there are La Cabanas I know all over the state. The one I found so far that I really love is the one in Helen. They have some of the best food. Uh, if you've never been there and you know where it's at and you can get there, you've got to try their food. It is out of this world. But um, yeah, that's gonna be it for today. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, uh, drop comments. And all of that sort of stuff. Um, I would really like to see comments. You know, I'd love to hear from you guys. 
to find out how I'm doing. So don't forget, stay safe out there. I love y'all to death. And as always, live to thrill.